welcome. I'm Dr. Alvaro Garcia. Today, I'm going to talk about inguinal hernias. What's an inguinal hernia? An inguinal hernia is a defect in the abdominal wall that occurs in the area of the inguinal canal. Also, very common associated with inguinal hernias are femoral hernias, which the defect occurs through the femoral canal. What's the inguinal canal, you might ask? It's a defect that occurs through the muscles that allow structures that come from the inside of the body to go through into the testicles in the men, and in the woman is the round ligament that support the uterus. What causes hernias? The most common cause of inguinal hernias are increasing abdominal wall pressure that occurs during lifting heavy objects. Also, these areas are prone to have congenital weaknesses that allows the hernias to reproduce. How are the hernias fixed? There's three ways to fix hernias. The open repair, the laparoscopic repair, and the robotic assisted repair. Each technique has its own indications for each particular hernia, but in general terms, an open hernia is for patients that have a very large hernia, very chronic hernia that requires an, opening, an open repair. During the open repair, the muscles are fixed, the, the tissues are reconstructed, and they're reinforced in a tension-free way with mesh. During the laparoscopic or robotic-assisted repair, the repair is done in a minimal invasive way with high, highly advanced technology that allows to reconstruct the anatomy of the inguinal canal and reinforce the tissues from behind the muscles with a tension-free technique. What's the recovery of an inguinal hernia repair? In ge general terms for an inguinal hernia, when it's performed open, it might take up to a week or two of some discomfort. In the robotic assisted or laparoscopic techniques, patients will recover generally much faster than that. What are the complications of hernias? Generally, it could be chronic pain or discomfort, but the likelihood is very small. If you have further questions about inguinal hernia or its repair, please call us back to the number underneath your screen, visit our websites, or send us an email to the email address below. Again, thank you for listening, and I'll see you in the next video.